What is up everyone? Today is round seven of the AFL 2023 season and I'm about to get our tips up for both me and Lachlan. <clears throat> so the first game tonight on Friday would be St Kilda and Port Adelaide. Um, we both tipped St Kilda. Obviously they had a very good form recently. Um, they've always made a comeback in almost, um, well, just one game that they played and also any time they had a, a moment behind the game, they'd always try to make a comeback. So yes, I definitely say uh, St Kilda for this one um, tonight and Lachlan also tips St Kilda as well. Then for tomorrow's match, we have Brisbane and Fremantle playing uh, the Gabba. So we both tip Brisbane for that one. Um, we decided to go for them because obviously... They obviously had a also a good form as well. Rio was um being kind of on and off. So because it's at the Gabba, Brisbane's home ground, we thought Brisbane might have the advantage there. So we decided, okay, um Brisbane will definitely be hopefully they should come out winners and that's what we thought as well for this game. Then for more games remaining we have the Sydney Derby between Sydney Swans and GWS at the NCG. Um so we both tipped Sydney. Obviously, two teams look pretty all right this season, but if it could be a close one, and we're not, um, hopefully, um, if not, we're definitely thinking Sydney could win that. And yeah, definitely, um, with the more, um, with the more like recent performances they've had, as well as preparation they've done too, we're thinking, hopefully, Sydney for that one for the Sydney Derby. Then we've got the Bulldogs and Hawthorne. Um, at Marvel, and we're thinking the Bulldogs as well. Of course, the Bulldogs had pretty good, um, you know, they've been looking quite tough, to be honest, whereas um, Hawthorne, unfortunately, though they're sitting last on the ladder, they've had a bit of um, shaky performances which and results as well, which could, um, which could be a little uh, thing for a team who was sitting 11th or 18th, if maybe had to be a team sitting on 16th or 17th, it would be pretty understandable. But um, this one, yeah, I mean, I am thinking uh, hopefully the Bulldogs for this one. And then the uh, one after that, we've got Melbourne versus uh, Kangaroos and so North Melbourne. We're both going for Melbourne at that one. Um, hopefully... Melbourne should pull off a good win, being very, been looking very good lately. Had a great win on Monday against the Tigers, so hopefully, yeah, we're just gonna think that um, for this time it'll be Melbourne um, taking home the win. So yeah. Then for the last game on Saturday, we've got West Coast and Carlton playing at Perth, but for this one, I'm thinking it could be Carlton that are having, I think, the odds to win. Um, not really familiar with betting, but we're just thinking because of like ladder positioning as well as like performance as well, preparation, like we said, everything. We also decided, yeah, um, hopefully Carlton for this one uh, can take home the win. Of course, the Carlton have been looking very good under Michael Voss, the coach. Um, but yeah, Carlton, of course, despite they lost to St Kilda last week, we're just thinking Carlton have really pulled off pretty good performances this season. Hopefully they should come home with the win from Perth and yeah, wrap up um, their weekend spent on Western Australia. Then for Sunday, we have Essendon and Geelong. We're thinking Essendon. Essendon came very close on their exact day against Collingwood. They could have won that, unfortunately. I don't think they scored a goal in the last quarter. A bit disappointing, but anyways, we're thinking Essendon for this one. Um, against uh, Geelong, so hopefully Essendon can pull off the win. Geelong have been a little on and off lately. Of course, they had a pretty rocky start to the season, but they picked up a little bit as they went. So hopefully we're just thinking for this one, it could be Essendon, but yeah, it could go either way. Um, but yeah, and I think Lachlan, Lachlan tipped Geelong for this one, but for me... Um, I'm just going with Essendon, but to be honest, it could be anybody. Because Geelong have been making a bit of a comeback, though it's pretty early on in the season, and we just hope that, um, yeah, you know, uh, we just hope, like, whoever wins, yeah, like, we'll just have to see, because it'll be pretty much a close one. Then we've got Richmond versus uh, Gold Coast at Marvel. Um, and I'm going to be honest, I'm thinking Richmond as well. Of 
course, whenever they played in Melbourne, um, it's always been, you know, a good one for them, Richmond. And, uh, yeah, like, they've always had a lot of fans coming out, supporting the boys behind them. And I'm just thinking, we both tip Richmond, and even though Richmond have been quite on and off lately, um, yeah, we're just thinking, hopefully, that this one, they can actually come win this game at Marvel and, uh, yeah... Um, go home with the win, but it could go either way. So let's just hope that Richmond <laughs> deliver the win. Then for our last game, we've got Adelaide and Collingwood. Um, Lachlan tipped Adelaide, but I'm going to have to go with my heart. I'm going to have to say it's Collingwood. Um, Collingwood, even though they're playing in Adelaide, um, <clears throat> and Adelaide might have an advantage at their ground. Um, I'm just thinking Collingwood have obviously, with the way they came back against Essendon on Monday, they could pull off a win like that, but we'll have to see how it goes. Because obviously, this game, it doesn't really matter where you play at home or away. You just have to really, like, it also depends on <clears throat> your recent performance, how you did, and your consistency as well. Though most of the games are played here in Melbourne, um, games should be played anywhere around Australia, so... Yeah, you just have to wait and see. But, of course, we I tip Collingwood for this one. Hopefully, Collingwood by roughly 10 points or more, or maybe 20-ish. And uh, Lachlan tipped Adelaide, because obviously they're playing in Adelaide. So, yeah, um, those are our tips for the week. Um, hopefully, we can get another game day vlog coming out if we have time to go. And every, we <clears throat> don't have much on. But yeah, stick with us for more videos on tipping, sports day vlogs, as well as more sporting updates. And we're thinking about doing an A-League game because it's now the final series with the soccer. So let's just hope, yeah, um, we can just follow up on that. Hopefully we can go to a game for that and uh, yeah, hopefully get some content on. So thanks for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you in the next video we're going to do.